Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Today, virtual yoga actor Yinka Koji pleads for long life as Mama Rimbo and many yoga actors and actresses celebrate today. Yinka Koji is a talented theatre arts practitioner and a film producer. He has produced many films, including Ojiji and Obai Lesson. He's also one of the founding fathers of the Shiba movie industry and Odufa Kakos, which is one of the strongest Kakos in the Yuba movie sector. Odufa Kakos has produced many star actors, including Funke Akindele Belu, Fitia Balogun, Said Balogun, just to mention a few of them. So, 85% of Yuba movie stars have passed through this Odufa Kakos. And today, many Yuba actors and actresses are jointly celebrating this Yuba actor. Yinka Koji, Rudy Mama Rimbo, Yinka Solomon, Adini Itayo, and many others. And in celebration of his own day, he says that there is no other way to say I'm grateful for life. Many are in the great beyond and oblivious of the passage of time. I desire to live long, to put a smile on people's faces. Everything has been orchestrated to favor me in this new year. I wish myself a glorious birthday. Also joining in to wish him a happy birthday and say that may God answer his prayers. Today, Yinka Kodri is 62 years old. For those who may ask who is the celebrant, please stay with us. His full name is Ganyu Akonyola Yinka Kodri, but then he's popularly known as Yinka Kodri Masomo. He's a renowned Yoba Nigerian actor, movie director, producer, and a motivational speaker. It was on September 16th, 1959, in Lagos Highland, part of Lagos State, but then originally is from Oro Village, a descent of Ibumina Omeji in Kora State. For his early life and education, he earned this primary school education at St. Catholic School in Idumu, part of Lagos State. Then he attended Christ High School in Ibute, Elefo, also in Lagos State, for his secondary school education. However, he could not finish his secondary school education, and he rather decided to start a business. It was later that he was trained as a dramatist and performing artist and he obtained the certificate of professionalism in theatre arts. He was born into a middle class polygamous family. His father was a wealthy man who had 22 children. When the young Ginka used to help his father to manage his business in the 1980s, he started combining acting with this other job. In the beginning, his father was against the part that his son chose, but then later on he supported it because he saw that his son was happy to be an actor. Yinka Kodri sadly lost his father in the year 1994 and his acting career officially started in the year 1976 when he dropped out of secondary school. Nika was so passionate about building his acting career that he sold a 504 car at that time to produce a movie video titled Ojiji which means Jideko Soko. Nika and Tai Wola Inka, along with other friends from the drama group called Afukbina Theatre Group. His debut as an actor was at Abidurugu, a warrior in an epic of the same title. He became popular, well known when he hit a nerve, finally interpreted the role of Fadba Mila in Lani Yonu, a television series, which is scripted and produced on the Lagos television. Back in those days, the television series was a must watch for fans of the old TV. Yinka admitted that the smooth running of this series was what shot him into the limelight. And it was also the same role of Yinka as Fadba Mila in Lani Yonu. That's one his parents over. And he revealed this in an interview. I faced stiff opposition. That is, I encountered serious family problems and criticisms. They didn't think that as a child from a rich and prestigious home, the theater was the best place for me. They wondered what I wanted to achieve with acting and just making people laugh. Enough of my childhood friends even stopped talking to me and associating with me. But as God would have it, I became popular and all those who chastised me ran back. They don't want her to be associated with me. Since then, this virtual actor has stayed in several Yoba films and TV series. Some of the popular ones include Ashiriowo, The Sweet of Wars, Beraga Pride, Afefefe, The Wind of Love, Ajemeta, The Three Witches, Owalatako, The Spider's Web, Kadarami, My Destiny, Olani Yonu Kutubu, Kura Eko, Abedoruko, Jiji, Eberiote, Araba, Hilari, Odumbaku, Bolodeuku, Ebu Dola Temi, Abeni, Abule Shogo, Niwo Yola, Ile Kwonlon, Okini, Rekodu, Enyo Gongo, Ulori Re Sababi, Uwan Lata Ko Ojo Ketala, Abe Shijobi, Apadi, Ujushe, Ojo Idajo, and Eni Abilebu, just to mention a few of them. This popular actor, film director, producer, has many awards attached to his name. The awards he has won over the years include Best Actor in a Supporting Role, 2007, African Movie Academy Awards. Best Actor in the Lead Role, 2014 Best Honorable Awards. 
CC People Movie Awards for Lifetime Achievement 2017, an award of excellence in recognition of his great performance in the field of entertainment. In 2004, by the Student Union, Federal College of Education at Koka in Yaba, this famous actor was also nominated for the following awards. Best Actor in a Supporting Role at 2007, the third African Movie Academy Awards. Best Indigenous Actor in the Liju, Yoruba Category, at 2010 Best Unknown Movie Awards. Best Actor in an Indigenous Movie, Non-English Speaking Language, at 2012 Nollywood Movies Awards. Best Supporting Actor in a Yoruba Film, at 2013 Best Unknown Movie Awards. Best Actor in a Liju, Yoruba Category, at 2014 Best Unknown Movie Awards. Just to mention a few of them. And apart from all this, he was also honored as the Abba King of Oro Kingdom some years ago. Today, Inka Koji is happily married with lovely children. And even one of his kids, his son, Muiwa Koji, has followed his father's footsteps. He has five children Ololade, Muiwa, Yiwande, Olajuwa, and Folari Koji. also has many grandchildren now. He's a devout Muslim and an allergy. And his second son, Muiwa, is the right hand man of Inka Koji. Also, apart from all this, there was a time that he was really good at playing table tennis. He grew up on the island and was roundly recognized as the unbeatable table tennis champion in that area. How the table tennis champ dumped that game of table tennis that made him popular for a career in acting is a story for another day. But then he summed up this story by recalling that he was inspired by the acting and filmmaking progress exhibited by the legends like the late chief Ubatu Gunde, Kola Ogumola Dula Dipo. Adi Emi Afolayan, aka Adi Love, and Pamosis Adi Juma, who we popularly know as Baba Salah. And in his words, Dima was exposed to their works both on stage and screen. Dima was moved to give acting his shots. Eventually did, but not after so many struggles. And he also revealed how his voice assured him that he was going to be as great as the late Pahu Batogunde and others. Once he put his mind in this acting totally, which was the deciding factor for him to venture into the movie industry. And today, Mas Somo is among the celebrated experience we have. So this is the little bit about this version of actor Inka Koji. We have come to the end of this episode. We have this version of actor Inka Koji, Mas Somo, complete for a long life as he celebrates his birthday. We hope you enjoyed this episode and learned on the two new things. And happy birthday once again to Mas Somo, version of actor Inka Koji. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.